The Meadowlands in New Jersey is the biggest track in harness racing and one of the very toughest to win at. And consequently, what happened last Saturday night was truly remarkable. Let's take a look at it, starting with the second race. Threshold now to take the lead with the 50 yards to come, and then Desperado's Dream, K-State Hanover, closing fast, but no catching threshold here, the winner by two. John Campbell winning with uh, Tresshold in the second race, and he comes back in the third. Two and a half lengths, Evertime charging on the outside, Hilt Duce coming up the rail now, extreme outside, Windproof is there, in between horses, Walkabout, they're coming to the finish, Hilt Duce getting through on the inside, Evertime, here's the wire, Il Duce has it. Through on the inside with the Shady Stable Nines, Il Duce and McKinsey Almahurst. That makes two. The next race up that he was victorious in was this one. Willie Mays is closing fast, but has run out of ground. Armbro Handy has it. Three in a row, Armbro Handy in 159. He's an Abercrombie owned by the Hunt Harness Horses. And uh, then came the feature on the card, the $35,000 Invitational. On the far outside, closing fast, here's the wire. Out of Chicago, Hothead wins in New Jersey. Uh, John Campbell, of course, driving in the last quarter in 26 seconds with a strong wind at his back. That's four wins in a row. Right back in the seventh race. Fleming has done it. John Campbell's won five. That makes five. Could he possibly win six on a Saturday night card? Let's see. With high bolt Osborne, and he's going to do it again. Campbell has done it with high bolt Osborne. It's close for second. Campbell's done it, as Tom Durkin says, but he still has a big race to go. Here's the $25,000 open for four- and five-year-olds. And he has done it. Seven wins on the card for John Campbell. That is the third time that John Campbell has won seven races on a single card at the Meadowlands.